Hey, what's up guys? Today I'll be doing a foreign lore challenge. Let's go. So in the YouTube world, I've been seeing some folks been doing the foreign lore challenge. The last time I saw one was realistic fishing. He did a fishing challenge using Japanese lure. He did some fishing with a, a, some jackal lure, which is from Shimano. So that's from Japan. So today I'll be fishing with some Ukrainian lures, fanatic baits. Let's see what I can catch today. Cool thing about these lures is that they put some secret formula sauce in here, which they actually kind of talked about it. If you go to their website, they say they actually use pond water. So technically, I'm, it's all natural. So let's see how this fares in New Jersey water. Ukraine, New Jersey, bass pickerels, what can I catch today? Let's see. All right guys, so let's pull one of these guys out of the bag. And you guys know me very well. The first thing you gotta do when you have some sort of a new soft plastic and it has some sort of a secret scent, you gotta go take a whiff. So, oh, nothing, nothing too crazy. But anyway, this is their boxer lure. Soft paddle tail swim bait, all right. So, as you guys may have noticed, I love using soft paddle tail, and this is basically the beginning of fall, so eventually covering water is essential to finding some predator fish. So I'm gonna put some heavy um, duty swim bait hooks from VMC. This is a 1 8 ounce, 3 aught. I probably wanna use a 4 aught belt. Um, I ran out of those. The, I do have some, but it's kind of heavy. So I'm gonna start off with the, the lighter weight for now. So I'm just gonna thread this bad boy on. And let's just get it up right. So it's, it's very interesting if you look at this lure. Uh, let me just hook this in and then I'll show you this lure a little closer. All right guys, so let's take a look at this lure. From the top view, it looks like it's pretty wide in the head, but you look on the side, it looks like it's a, lot, a little thinner. So it kind of looked like a, a, a mushroom head. Um, let's not think about anything inappropriate, but this is a purple lure with some uh, purple, blue, silver flakes. And it's a small paddle tail, but it's very thin, uh, finesse type paddle tail swim bait. So I'm sure this is going to catch me some fish. So let, why don't we go wet the line and see what we catch. Some at top or water column. That looks good, huh? Alright, let's go catch some fish. Here we go. Ah, oh, that was first fish. Mmm. Ah. There we go. Oh yeah. Is is that a bass? Heck yeah. All right, dude, this is what I'm talking about. This bass is just chilling in those mats. Look at that. All right, let me just do a quick photo of this fanatic bait. Come on, buddy. Phone's acting funny. All right. Oh, are you serious? Phone, running out of memory or something. All right, let's just get you out. Actually, I want to do enough fold like this. All right, buddy. Cool beans. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I am, that was a dumb move. But uh, you guys got a little splashy effect right there. All right, on to the next one. All right, usually after the first hit of any sort of fish, I am gonna assess the lure and see how it looks like. I mean, it didn't look like it's beat up too bad. You can see that the head's starting to tear a little bit, but that's not because of just the fish. It's because I was fishing and I'm ripping into weeds and I had picked off a lot of weeds earlier. So uh, I say fishing this 30 minutes so far and that was the first fish that I actually hooked on. I um, had a few other hits. You know, it's, it's pretty durable. So let's keep going.
Here we go. Got another fish. I think this looks like a pickerel to me. Yes. All right. Oh, you see that aer aerobatic jump? Dude, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, chill out, chill out, chill out. All right. Look at that. That's what I call a nice hook. Right on the, just the edge of the lip. Look at that. Quick unhook and release. Good pickerel. Let me check it out a little further this time. Don't want to get splashed because it's pretty shallow and muddy here, you know? All right, two fish, two. Look, it's, looks pretty durable still. Look at that, second fish that successfully landed and it's still holding up okay. I gotta definitely twist that back up. So let me just twist that back up. All right, fixed it. So still good to go. Let's keep catching some fish. Guys, this is a big paw. Like, look at that. That is a big paw. Uh, man, I don't know if there's wolves around here, but holy smokes. Here's another one. This one's a little bit more clear, but I can't tell if it's even a wolf. It looks like it goes this way right here. That way. Ah, <sighs> well. Gotta go catch some fish. Let's hope I don't get eaten. This used to be some awesome pan fishing spawning grounds. <gasps> yes, that's a fish right there. Oh yeah. Oops, sorry, I hit the camera. Oh, he's full of weeds now. Man, I can't see what it is. All I see is a big pile of weeds. Thank God for this reel right here. Got so many pounds of drag. And it is a bass. Oh, sweet. That's what y'all like. All y'all people watch videos always love bass. Let's see. Let's get it out of your face. Oh, 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 yo, 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 yo. Chill out. Oh, oh. dude, I got you. Dude, dude, you, you got me. Oh, I am so splashed up with dirt and mud. Why is he going to kill me? Camera got a little wet too, but I'll leave it at as, as is for now because my arm is pretty muddy right now. Holy smokes. Oh, yes. A little bass. All right. In you go. Don't splash me to sound like the other guy. All right. Go back where you came from. Quote from Extreme Philly Fishing. So, this lure does do pretty good. These Ukrainian lures from Fanatic. Fanatic baits does catch fish and they're pretty hardy. I could definitely use it a couple more times. Uh, I'm squeezing ahead and it looks pretty door box to screw back on and off I go. But since this is technically a foreign lure challenge, I'm gonna give you guys one more lure that I'm just gonna preview for you guys. I'm gonna try to catch one fish with it. I'm not gonna focus too much on it because the focus of today is this guy, but I wanna give you guys something a little bit more than just one lure. So stay tuned for one second. I'm gonna tie that on and we're gonna go catch some fish. All right, guys, see all those fishing, see all those lily pads, guys? I was having some trouble casting to them. So I said, I wanna do some top water frogging. So I'm gonna show you guys a lure from Thailand, all right, this type of frog is called jump frog. I'm not gonna jump into too much details because I'm gonna create another video about these type of frogs from Thailand. And again, these are called jump frogs and it's pretty neat. You can take a look at this. Basically this, in Thailand originally, this is supposed to be made out of wood, but this guy actually made by plastic by this specific brand. Uh, they have a little skirt in the back and this is how the hook looks like. That's the frog hook right there with the wire little weed guards. So I'm gonna get it out there and see if I can catch some bass. Let's go. Got him! Yes! Woohoo! Gotta pull him through the weeds. All right, look at that. Ooh, top water frog in with the Thailand shrimp frog. Look at that, bam! Not a big one, but I got him. Look at that. All right. You know what? I gotta do a quick photo with this guy here. All right. Let's un unhook this guy. Come on. Sh sharp hooks. Let's put him a little further away. Oh, came off my finger. Scraped me up pretty well too. 
So that is the foreign lord fishing challenge. I was able to catch some fish using two different lures from two different countries. I first started off with Fanatic baits. I was using their purple swim bait and I was able to catch three fish with it. I caught a bass first, then a pickerel, then another bass. So that was pretty fun. Then I gave you guys a bonus. I kind of jumped into the top water fishing with the Thailand style called jump frog. I'm not gonna go too much details because this video is actually focused on the Fanatic bait. If you guys want to see me do some more top water fishing with some Thailand lures, leave me a comment below. I really love top water fishing, but I don't know why I don't do uh, that many top water fishing this year. To me, top water fishing is like playing Frogger, but instead of trying to dodge cars, you actually try to trigger strikes from fish, jumping, jumping from lily pads to lily pads. They should make a fishing game with that. Anyway guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a like. And if there's anything you guys want me to fish with next, leave me some suggestion in the comment box below. If this is the first time you guys watching my video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button because there will be plenty of more fishing this fall. Until next time guys, tight lines, the fish don't wait, get out there, go!